the four main social teaching practices. The first part in this first practice is called student-centered discipline. This refers to a classroom or a school discipline where the students understand the importance of procedures being implemented and the how and why of those procedures and processes and what are the consequences of breaking them. Second is teacher language. Teacher language is crucial in developing self-confidence and an atmosphere of acceptance in the classroom. Simple encouragement like a smile, praise and accepting mistakes can have a profound effect on students' self-confidence. Third is responsibility and choice. To become responsible decision makers, students should start practicing decision making at a young age. You know, while also learning the consequences of their decisions, they should know what kind of decisions to make. The next, the fourth one, is warmth and support. It is critical that students feel welcomed in their classrooms and that they are appreciated and loved. Building positive relationships with them, getting to know their strengths, interests and abilities helps build a feeling of belongingness. They need to be listened to and appreciated as individuals and known within their life context as well as their home and community experiences.